how to know when you're making a living, but not truly living a life of Jesus Christ. You know, you can go through this whole life and gain the world, but lose your soul and never live because you never was connected to Jesus Christ. None of us are perfect. Some of us are alcoholics. Some of us are whoremongers. Some of us are a little of everything. Some of us are murderers. Some of us do a little of everything. None of us are perfect. But God say all the sins are the same in his eyes. I know some of you think because you don't lie, you're better than a thief. And if you don't thief, you're better than a murderer. If you don't murder, you're better than a whoremonger. I know you think you're better than your sin is better than the other person's sin. But God said in, in his eyes, all sins are equal, no matter how big or small you think they are. So if you're not connected to Jesus, you don't know Jesus, you're not living. In this world, you constantly need a constant diet of Jesus in order to truly dodge these demonic darts and attacks that the devil and his demons are real. It's not just a fairy tale. These things get in you when you got to be careful who house you go over. You got to be careful where you sleep. You got to be careful who you, most importantly, who you have sex with. You know, who you hug, who you handshake. These demons can transfer. That's why you got to stay, you have to stay filled with the Holy Spirit. Because if you stay filled with the Holy Spirit, These things will run out. They won't even. They won't even hold on to you long. They can't even. If you. If your light get bright enough, they not. They can't get in. Now demons may not be able to take over you, but some demons can hold on for a while, and then they'll leave because you got Jesus in you. If you don't got Jesus in you, then some genius, some demons, and some demons are geniuses. Some demons can latch onto your brain and influence your thoughts and your emotions, your press on certain fears, traumas. So I recommend that you don't fall for that trap. I recommend you don't fall for the banana in the tailpipe. That's what I recommend. You know, I recommend that you just chill, stay close to Jesus. Don't dwell on your sins, your failures, because all fa all sins, all failures is not sin. Some failures are just to get stronger and to get people. Some failures are just to prepare you for a blessing. Because if you didn't make that wrong turn, then you would have never ran into this. You would have never know that and that. So it's a puzzle piece. Don't fall victim. You know, don't fall into self righteousness. Don't be scared. To make a mistake, like some people are scared to make mistakes and all that stuff. Don't fall for it, man. You stay prayed up, man. I'm Alan Rillionaire. Follow me on my Instagram link at Alan Rillionaire Show. On Instagram, you can let me know you want a consultation. If you want my latest book passage, um, if you want my the latest technique, um, trick technique on how to be a magnet to beautiful women of your choice, you know they'll. Chase after you, sit on your lap, laugh at your jokes, blow your phone up. If you want to experience that, it's $40. Message me on Instagram and let me know you want the trick, the technique, whatever you want to call it. Um, all my songs and albums are in the description box. Everything in the description box. A lot of you have been asking me how you can donate. The PayPal and Cash App is in the description box. Um, that's pretty much it. Watch the next video all the way through. Press like, subscribe, hit the bell. I'll holler at y'all later. I'm out, all right? Much love. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name.